Hey guys, this is Hell Hades, free to play, 2023. Guys, the portal's gone purple. I got three void shards. I'm on day five, I think. My fifth day of playing, actually day six in game. Clan v Clan is on. There's a chance, a ten times chance to get a Krizia. And these void shards came from the referral program, or two of them did. One of them came from campaign. I've decided, because so far I've pulled no champions, apart from Kale, that are worth taking to six star, and I kind of, I'm thinking about who should be my next six star right now, I've decided I'm going to pull the three voids, okay? I would say early, early game, like within the first three weeks, before you've got three six stars, maybe four six stars, pulling shards apart from sacreds is not a bad thing. I say hold sacreds because sacreds can be the difference between you winning a fusion next time around or not. Ancient shards, you know, I'd say in the first few weeks it's worth pulling ancient shards, especially if there's a summoning event on. And void shards, kind of similar really. You're better off to save and wait for a summoning event. Not necessarily a fusion, but some form of event. But I'm just like, you know what? We're gonna YOLO the free voids and see if I can get an Acrisia, which would be insane. But Honestly, just an epic. I've not pulled a single epic from any shard at all on the free-to-play yet. So we're YOLO in the three voids, and we're hoping to see some sort of purple patch. We've got Scrapper. Uh, Scrapper is kind of basically useless. Basically useless. We're carrying on with the theme of useless rares. Let's go again. Two more. I've just seen other people, everyone else is getting like cool stuff. Everyone else in the challenge, apart from actually me and in fairness, Lady H. We're pick they're picking up epics, they're picking up legendaries. I'm picking up Painsmith. Come on, one more. One more. Be purple. It's not purple. What's an interesting one? Doom Screech. Actually, an interesting one. So, this is my first. Term meter filler. Doesn't give me increased speed as well, though, which you kind of want from a term meter fill. And he doesn't bring that much else. But he does give me fat, big fat increased defense. And term meter fill. There's a shield on himself and there's an AoE hit. Oh, this is a tricky one. He's, he's better than anything else I've got, but I don't know if he's worthy of really anything more than a level 40 it kind of is worthy of a level 40 and you know spot at the moment at least in my arena team turn me to feel big fat increased defense in case i take a hit maybe that is someone that's actually worth using i don't know guys but the free to play luck of the shard continues every single shard i've pulled has been a rare apart from mystery bloody shards anyway i'll see you in the next one